Good evening guys, this is my short video on energy systems. This is just an exemplar that you guys could use for your own assignment. So I'm going to cover energy systems today. So energy systems for basketball. So energy work systems work in conjunction. So it's not like one turns off and one turns on. Depending on the level of intensity required will mean which system is more dominant. Okay, so if we're being super explosive, the most uh, dominant system might be ATP CP, but the other two systems are still working in the background. So it's all dependent on level of intensity. Um, energy system is measured in 220, uh, well, the intensity is measured in 220 miles your age, which relates to your VO2 max. So the percentage of this is in beats per minute and will determine the level of intensity. So if we're working at 65 to 85% um, and we're using the aerobic system, that's the most dominant system and that could be 170 to 190 beats per minute, for example, or 140 to 170. Um, ATP CP, so the fuel is ATP, the waste product is AT ADP, um, there's no oxygen required, uh, the percentage heart rate max is 95 to 100%, the muscle Fibre type is very explosive. It lasts, uh, depending on the athlete, but in general terms, zero to 10 seconds. Uh, basketball examples could be the jump shot, the layup, block, rebound, drive to the hoop, basically anything that's explosive. Um, and in here, I haven't got any in here, but you'd have a couple of short videos on maybe a video of a layup, you're explaining it. Maybe a video of a jump shot, video of um, a drive to the hoop. The next system is the anaerobic system. It's another explosive system. It's fueled by ATP. The waste product is lactic acid. There is no oxygen available. Um, that's why the waste product is lactic acid. It works at around a percentage heart rate max of 95, 85 to 95%. Muscle type, fiber type is still uh, quite fast. Um, and the duration in general terms is 10 seconds per minute. So that could be a long play down the court. So you might have worked really hard on defense, you got a rebound, and you travel up the court and score a point. So it's lasting longer than zero to 10 seconds. Um, movement around the shot clock in a tight game, maybe. So the shot clock's 25 seconds. So if you're working explosively for that whole shot clock time off the ball and with the ball, um, that could be when the anaerobic is system will be working as an example and in here I'd have some examples of videos just a couple of short videos like 10 second videos of the anaerobic system uh, the aerobic system is our general base um, system for any sport well most sports um, the fuel is oxygen and glucose the waste product is um, co2 so our body's pumping oxygenated blood to those working muscles uh, the higher the intensity, the more oxygenated muscle, uh, blood that needs to be pumped, and what's been breathed out is the CO2. It's working at 65 to 85% of the VO2 max. The fiber type is slow, and best examples would be just the general fitness of the game, and you could finish with um, here explaining. I had a photo, um, a video of LeBron doing um, just generalized fitness um, for basketball, but uh, YouTube wouldn't let me use it because of the rights.